This is not financial advice, it's not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button on the YouTube algorithm and stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Like I tell y'all every day, the data they release is, is false. Listen, Goldman Sachs, and this is just my opinion, is having real liquidity liquidity issues. I I see that I see them having having major problems in the near future. And that's just my opinion. I'm not telling you to buy Goldman Sachs. I'm not telling you to hold Goldman Sachs. I'm not telling you to sell Goldman Sachs. I'm telling you that I believe, in my opinion, based on the DD that I have done, based on what I'm seeing in the market, that Goldman Sachs is in a lot of trouble. And now Goldman Sachs has a department. And it's their consumer the consumer loan department. You know, they, they, they deal with, with, you know, personal loans. They got a credit card called Marcus. They have a other a branded credit card with uh with Apple. They have a, a branded credit card with General Motors. But here's the thing: these cards, this sector of Goldman Sachs is losing money hand over fist, and they don't know what to do. They are attempting to to sell it. But it's hard to find buyers in an industry that's not looking good. And on top of that, everybody knows where the market is headed. So if it's already bad and a recession hasn't really kicked in yet, how bad is it going to be six months from now? If these consumers that they've loaned money to are not paying these loans, and the market hasn't got that bad yet. The recession hasn't really kicked in yet. People are still working and they're not paying. What is going to happen six months, 12 months down the line? Their consumer department is going to be a whole lot worse. And that is why they're trying to, and, and this is just my opinion, they're trying to load it off on somebody else. But people are doing their DD, other companies are doing their, doing their DD, and they are not comfortable. They are not comfortable purchasing Goldman Sachs Consumer Department. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that if consumers are not paying now, are they going to be paying in six months when the economy is in a lot worse position? I don't think so. Anyway, I appreciate y'all enjoying with me. God bless.